Hey, y'all. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you. Okay, so you guys asked, and I'm going to show you how I pack all of my stuff in this carry-on suitcase. It's really not that hard, but it is a technique, and it takes a while to get used to, so let's get started. All right, so I just got back from my weekend trip with my friends. I was packing my carry-on and thought that after I packed it, like, man, I should have recorded it and show people how I do that. So if you have pants like these, the technique is pretty simple. You want to make sure that you have the pants folded in half like this. And then you want to fold the edge here in. And then at the end here, you're just gonna bring it up. One, two, and three. Sometimes you could do it four times. This right here looks a little big to me, so I'm gonna try to do it again. So one, two, three, and four. Boom. Place it to the side. So when you have shirts, you wanna make sure that you flatten them out. Fold them in like this, fold that back, fold the other side in, fold that back, and you're going to do that same tri or quad fold. So, one, two, three, four, boom. Jean jacket, which is an item that I love to bring with me. So what I did was I buttoned it so that it makes it easier for me to fold, pop the collar up, and then you're going to use that same method like you use on the t-shirt, fold it. This has longer sleeves, so you're going to bring that sleeve back like this, and then fold this side over on top of that one. But you want to bring the sleeve inside so that both sleeves are on the inside. Like that. And then we're going to use that same tri-fold. So, one. Two. Boom. That's a whole outfit. I had a little dress that I took with me, too. So you're gonna use that same method. The method is the same for everything, no matter what it is. Fold that in, there's no sleeves to worry about. Fold this in, no sleeves to worry about. Same tri or quad fold. One, two, three, wrap those around, boom. Show you some jeans. So the jeans are the same thing. You lay them out the same way you did the other pants. People always worry about jean material like I just did that jean jacket. It's really not that hard. You just do the tri-fold. So you fold this in here in the same quad or tri-fold. One. Two. Three. And four. Good. Let me show you how I folded my kimono. Like this. Um, you want to fold it too because when you ball it up and put it in there, it takes up more space. So you want to make sure that you fold everything, people. It's the key here. Fold it in half. Fold it again. And we're using that same thing. Boom, boom. So now it takes up less space. And so, you know, you can't put it in like this takes up tons of space so what i like to do is just fold it in half and then i push one cup down so that they're both in the same thing and put the straps in and then take it with me you want to fold those two trifold boom 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 put the underwear together and then I just kind of stick all my other stuff. So I got all my underwear and stuff here. It takes up way less space. And guess what else you need to fold? Your socks. Because if you have five pairs of socks and you put them in a ball like this, it's going to take up too much space. So take your socks. 
flatten them out. These are my nighttime socks. Yes, I do sleep with socks on. My friends think I'm a weirdo. Traveled. Boom. Boom. And then I just kind of fold this part back a little bit. And then you have your sock. All right, on to my favorite part. So most people like to... Let me take this out too so I can show you guys how I put it in. Most people like to put their clothes together when you put them in the suitcase, which is not necessarily the best practice um, because you want to make sure that you have all the heavier things at the bottom of the suitcase where the wheels are so that when you stand your suitcase up, it won't tip over. I know that used to happen a lot to me. And it was because you put the heavier things like at the top or in the middle and that causes the suitcase to uh, fall over when you're trying to carry it or in the airport. So you want to make sure that all the heavier things are to the bottom. Of course, the heaviest things that I have, the most heaviest is going to be this jean jacket and the jeans that we just folded up. So I'm going to put those in first at the bottom. And I make sure that they are only on one side. So you want to make sure that your folds are small enough so that you have room here. So at the bottom part where the wheels are, stuff them in there. Get all my jean items in. So you're basically just putting everything in lightest to heaviest. And then I have one, two, three, four, five pairs of shoes I'm going to stick in there. But first, I'm going to stick my... So I use this part up here for my underwear and stuff. I'm going to stick that in there. I have this other bra, too, that doesn't have those cups. So I'm going to stick that there. So when I stick this in here, it's only taking up one side. So I have room to put my socks and stuff here I only had one pair of socks this time so I stick that in there but I did have a bag of jewelry I was taking with me so I stuck that in there as well because I had enough room and believe it or not I still have a little bit of room to put something else in there if I wanted to and then after I do that I'm gonna start putting my shoes in I just took a bunch of flats this time so it was easy to make these fit I just put them together like that placed them in here Got the other pair, did the same thing. Like this. Placed it in there. Another pair of flats I took with me. Did the same thing like that. So I'm already up to three pairs of shoes. Got my Burks with me. I just placed them kind of on top of each other. Boom. And another pair of flats. Boom. We do have two pairs of night clothes that I was taking with me. Still have a piece of space right here. So I just stuck those down in there. I used the trifold method so they're nice and small. I have my pouch. And my toiletry bag and an extra mask and uh, I think that's all this is a carry-on and it fits 